All right. So today we're going to talk about leech therapy. What is it? Is it is it actually something that people actually do? Well, yes, they do. There's a lot of clinics. I know at least in the United States they have clinics, but leech therapy has been around for a very long time. And in 2004, the FDA approved medical leeches as a treatment for plastic and reconstructive surgery. Now, why? What can it do? Well, apparently it helps venous congestion. So it can speed up healing. Um, in the saliva of leeches, there's over a hundred bioactive substances with a wide range of effects, acting as an anticoagulant, blood thinner, vasodilator, anesthetic, antibiotic effect. So in a diabetic, it can help suppress blood clotting. Diabetics normally have thicker blood and with one of the main bioactive substances called herudin, which is 10 times more effective than heparin. So what are some of the conditions that people are using this therapy for? Venous congestion, like I said, certain cardiovascular effects to help reduce uh, the clotting mechanism systemically in stroke patients and heart attack patients. People with arthritis can benefit, um, people with high blood pressure, people who have hemorrhoids, blood clots, and even skin disorders. So because I study so many different topics, I, I saw this um, therapy and I was, at first I'm like, leech therapy, really? So apparently it's a valid therapy and a lot of people are using it. Hey, before you go real quick, I have a course entitled How to Bulletproof Your Immune System. It's a free course. I want you to take it. And here's why. Here's you. Here is your environment. Everyone is focused on this over here, avoiding your environment. But what about here? What about strengthening your immune system? That's what's missing. This course will show you how to bulletproof yourself. And so you can tolerate and resist your environment much better by strengthening your own immune system. I put a link down in the description right down below. Check it out and get signed up today.